made his case before the UN General Assembly on Tuesday that the world must remain united in defending Ukraine against Russian aggression, warning that no nation can be secure if we allow Ukraine to be carved up as he tries to rally support for Kiev's effort to repel a nearly 19-month-old Russian invasion that has no end in sight. U.S. U Wars. President called on world leaders to not let support for Ukraine diminish, arguing that Russia is counting on countries to grow tired of prolonged conflict in Kiev which will allow it to brutalize Ukraine without consequence. Russia alone is standing in the way of a resolution, Biden argued saying that Moscow's price for peace was Ukraine's capitulation, Ukraine's territory and Ukraine's children. Ask you this, if we abandon the core principles of the United States to appease an aggressor, can any member state in this body feel confident that they are protected? Biden said in his address, if we allow Ukraine to be carved up, is the independence of any nation secure? He continued, I'd respectfully suggest the answer is no. The president's forceful rhetoric on Ukraine appeared aimed not just for a global audience but for Washington, where an increasingly isolationist strain of the Republican Party is jeopardizing the prospects of the U.S., successfully replenishing the steady flow of aid that has gone to Kyiv since the war began in February 2022.